gonna do today? We're gonna learn uh -huh. and play. Okay. Sing a song and pray. That's right. God really loves us. God really, really cares about you, me, our families. That's right. God's always right there. Ooh. Let me fix my curls. You've tuned into Cali's world. That's right, boys and girls. Welcome to Cali's world. Chip, I got it. I figured out what I want to do when I grow up. Oh, really? What? Are you ready for this? Um, I think so. Yes. Yes, I am. Okay. I want to be a painter. Whoa. All right. I could use your help. I have a little birdhouse that I need to be painted. I'm thinking like a fire engine red with maybe some blue stripes. Huh? Uh, no. Not that kind of painter. Oh, well, what kind of painter do you want to be? I want to be a painter of pictures. But if you paint over the pictures, then people won't be able to see them. No, Chip. Like, I will paint the pictures. You know, like an artist. Oh, that's great. I think you would be great at that. Thanks. I feel like painting right now. I'm going to. I'm going to paint something here on this blank space on my wall. My parents already said I could. Wait. Can I paint too? Can we paint together? Yeah. Okay. Let's paint. Okay. So I'm going to begin by painting a single line here. Slowly and delicately. And I'm going to... <gasps> um, Chip, that's how you paint? Yeah. Why? What's wrong? Um, it's just we don't paint the same way. It's very different the way you paint. And I'm just wondering if we can still paint together. Well, I think we can. What do you think, Callie? Friends, have you ever had to play or paint with someone who does things differently than you do? Or with someone who isn't exactly like you? What did you do? I need to keep wondering about this while we check out our Bible story. It's time for today's Bible story, and it comes from the book of Matthew, chapter 9. One day, Jesus saw a man named Matthew who was a tax collector. Tax collectors collected money from people. Lots of them would take more than they were supposed to and keep it. So people really didn't like them. But Jesus went up to Matthew and said to him, follow me. So Matthew got up and followed Jesus. Matthew invited Jesus and his friends over for dinner. Some people saw this and asked the disciples, why does Jesus eat with tax collectors knowing that they sin and steal money from people? Jesus told them that he was like a doctor who could help sick people. He came to spend time with the people who needed him. That included everybody, even a tax collector. Matthew and other tax collectors were not liked by a lot of people, but Jesus didn't ignore them. Jesus included them because he knew God loved them. We can and should all do the same thing. I can include people who aren't like me. that if Jesus was painting with Chip, he wouldn't mind that Chip didn't paint like him. Can you imagine Chip and Jesus painting together? <laughs> Chip, I'm sorry I said that we shouldn't paint together. It's just, I saw the way you were painting and it wasn't like how I did it. At first I didn't know what to do. But the Bible story reminded me that Jesus included everybody. Jesus made sure nobody felt left out even when they were different from everyone else. So I'm going to do that too. Awesome, let's paint. I like that. Thanks, Chip. I like all the colors you painted with and how you fill up the whole page. Nothing goes unpainted. That's my Chip painting philosophy. This is really fun. I'm glad we kept painting together even though we do things differently and have different ideas about what we will be like when we grow up. Friends, how can you include someone who isn't like you this week? You might be surprised how much fun you have. Jesus taught us how by including people like Matthew in reminding us. 
I can't include people who aren't like me. Thanks for learning and growing with me. Bye, friends. <laughs>